Hi guys, this is Max Tapper again with Howcast. Today I'm gonna to show you how to do an incline dumbbell press, all right? Now basically, the incline means our bench is gonna be slanted up. So the purpose of uh, incline bench press is to work our upper pec and the front of our shoulder, all right? Now this is the position we're gonna be in. Let's go back. This is our starting position. We need to make sure that our shoulders are pinched back and our chest is out. All right, now out to the side, down to about parallel to the floor, and we're back up to the top. Out to the side, parallel to the floor, back up to the top. Out to the side, parallel to the floor, and in. Now, one tip for you guys is, when you're doing this type of dumbbell press, you do not need to bring your, the bar or the, the dumbbell to your chest. Depending on how long your arms are, that'll put you at a huge mechanical disadvantage and a lot more stress on the shoulder again. So be very cognizant of where your arms are in space. Parallel to the floor for your upper arm is gonna be more than enough to recruit all the muscle fibers you need in your chest. Now, one tip I have for an inclined bench press is to make sure that the weight you're handling is right for you. Now, if your back is arching too much when you're pressing, you're putting too much stress in your lower spine, and obviously that's a no-no. So handle the weight that you can control. The incline press is harder than the flat bench, so you will not be using the same amount of weight. Just remember that. When we kick back, go into our press, you never wanna see this coming off the bench. You wanna make sure you're able to control it 100% of the time. Up and in. Enjoy, stay safe.